Good day guys, welcome to Nobu Creative Digital Marketing Agency, hope you guys are doing great. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you the step to stay to um to print out to your work um, piece of lab and also to just give it to the printer and the printer will know what to do next after you just print your work outside. So the very best thing you have to do right now is to download this app, Photo Resizer. So this is the app we're downloading, Photo Resizer. So this is the app for the resizer. So you need to have the app on your phone before you do any work on it. So after you download the app, the next thing now is to go to your pixel app and you click on the work you want to do. So I'm going to show you something that you need to know about this work right now. So this is the work. Um, no, this um, this is another work. Um, let me show you the work you need to do. So let's say this is the work you want to print out, and this um pixel lab um pixel lab size. The custom size is is 1280 1280 and actually it is 4 by 4 or 1 1 so can you see right now so the image size for printed banner is 4 by 4 let me show you one of the banner that I printed so um this is ambi that I printed so I'm going to look for the um the banner that I printed so let's go to the banner so the 4 by 4 size it actually can actually give you this size So this is the 4x4 size to give you this banner. So this 4x4 size give me this banner that I printed. So I'm going to show you this um this um this design in piece of also. So can you see right now? So this is the MB that I converted it to. So right now you need to convert the MB to pixel lab. So I'm I'm mean, sorry in photo resizer so that you can actually save your stress. So yeah, so let's, so let's go to the next stage. So after um after you go after you save that as 4x4 for banner. The next thing you're going to do right now is to go to your um photo resizer to receive it. But before you go, you need to know one thing about photo p uh, sorry about pixel lab is that when you want to save your work as an image, don't save it as as p as jpng. Just save it as png and save it as very high. I'm going to show you something. Good. Remember, we just save it as png and um and a. Uh, very high so let's save it also as jpng jpng and i'm very high the reason why we are saving as png is because the image quality will, will come out that, that means the image so guys let's continue mm -hmm. so, so let's continue guys so so guys let's continue you know uh, we save it as jpng and also png and i'm going to show you something uh why do we save it as png to um for printing is because um in PNG's form to it will bring out the data very high but in jpng the, the data will be very low like the mb will be very low and in printing they need much data so let's go so i'm going to show you in photo resizer the mb the mb so let's say this is the work you want to print you've already saved it by four by four in pixel lab or one to eighty one to eighty it actually design size to four by four so now the next after you save it the next thing you're going to do right now is to go to your photo resizer so this is the photo resizer this is it good so let's go so you have to go to your photo resizer then let me say so let me show you the store we just saved right now so let's say so after you open it to show you just click on to gallery then you click on piece of now i want to show you something now this is the image which this is the image was saved as jpng this is the image we save as JPNG. Can you see the size? The size is 1.8 MB. But look at the JPNG on. JPNG is 1.43 MB. So can you see that PNG is Wow no. Let me check again. Let me check the one we should save as JPNG because PNG should be the one to be more than the JPNG. So let me check as PNG and very high. Good. So let's go back to this site. Wow, JPNG is the MB is more than um is more than the JPNG is more than PNG. Yeah. Wow, 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 wow. But um in this place that I just saved right now, I saved this one as PNG, CPNG. I saved it as PNG. Then I save this one as 
GPNG. But in case you give me two or uh, two things, so you actually go for the one that the MB is much larger. So we are using GPNGs for this. That means we are using the one with much um, MB. So let's go. So after that, you click on this and then you click on Mac. So you can you see? I'm not sure if this page is okay. No, GPNG. Come let me check something. This JPNG is I'm not sure of it. Okay, good. So let's go. It's actually okay. Now you just click on batch results. You are seeing something right by it. Just, just click on it. And after batch results, you are going to be using PC for it, not percentage. Just, just click on PC and remove this thing from here. So remove the maintain as per ratio because if you leave it if you leave it as maintain as per ratio if you don't remove it from there what you type here in while is what it will give you in height or so that means you can edit it so now you want to convert you want to convert it to the ambi size so the ambi size now I'm going to be using one one two eight four one two eight four I'm going to check something right now one two eight four nine six five nine six five Good. So can you see right now? Can you see the size reduce? One two eight four, one two eight four nine six five. So that is what we use. Yeah, that is what we use in um in converting the the size to an ambi size. But now there's something you need to do right now. When you go back to your gallery and let me say this is the one we just saved right now. This is the photo that the one we just saved right now. Can you see right now that it is an ambi size? And let's say you want to check the um, the data the size of it can you see it can you see the size forty eight can be but let let's check the size in photo resizer again let me check something in photo resizer so let's go back let's say you want to check the original the one you just save right now the um the size you want to save it now good so can you see the size that the size is four seven four 0.44 KB, so it's not even up to 1.1 MB. Now, what would we do now to so even give it to give it the actual MB you want to give it to? So now you have to go to your photo to your pixel lab again. So after you go to your pixel lab again, don't delete anything from there because you have much data yet to do. So now the next thing you have to do right now is just to click on this use image from gallery, just click on it, and after you click on it, just click on on present the one you just see right now so this is it so just click here click here click here so that you you won't edit anything it, it won't cut out anything so can you see it right now so after you do that just do it like this and after that just click from gallery then bring out the image bring out the size again then after that just go to your related size and increase it like this so can you see it actually the same thing now so nothing is doing it again so just check the size here image size here don't mind them you have already converted uh, the size wow you see i have to I, I have done myself go back again click here where you click and give it like this so actually you are you allow this one to be um to be the size you want so can you see right now can you see that we are good to go so after that just save it as image save it as png and save it as very high again save it as as jpng and as very high again good so after that after that now you have the number of your printer or you want to or, or you want to go there so when you go there they will know what to do and i need to tell you something but if you have a client that you want to send it for like this one let me see like this one i send the one for let me see oh my pastor told me to so it's one of the client that i designed for the printer so can you see the design that i designed for him also the joy banner so i just sent it to him i sent it to him as png and i also sent it to him as as um as png so now just save just send it to him as document so how we can say that how can you send it to him as document just click this play you are seeing here this thing just click it. we don't know to send as png just as i mean sorry as document you click here after you click there you click on document then you go to your do browse doc then you go to your recent then you click on this tool now double click it then you select it 
so you send it to him but not to send it to him let me go to my second number i have two numbers so let let's do let's say you click on it again click on document click on browse other documents go to where it is so can you see it so just click on then it's just send so now so just send it to the printer like this the printer will know what exactly it will do so after the if if it is banner you want to send right now there's something you need to know in banner that what um pixel lab pixel lab font sorry pixel lab color pixel lab color is um is 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 rgb rgb yeah that is pixel lab that is pixel lab color but if you want to if you want to print if you want to print banner although you can leave it as if you want to print the rb under the rb you can leave it as rgb but if if you go there um the color you gave to it is not what you print is not what you print out now you have to tell the printer to change to crmk crmk ccrmk cymk so let me check it let me check let me check let me check so let me check it and coming so now what to give it is just give it cmyk so i'm correct cmyk yeah cmyk so just tell the printer to change the print as cmyk so tell the printer to change the to change the color to same way here so after you change the color to same way here it will actually give you the um the the exact color you need yeah the exact color you need so i hope this you find this video helpful um if you are new you are just kindly subscribe to the to the channel um don't forget to turn on the notification bell to get more updates from me um don't forget to to share and comment on the video thank you for watching until now thank you